Hey guys, what is going on? It is Matt from Fit Double Gaming TV, and welcome to the San Diego Padres franchise here on MLB 15, the show on the PS4. Your first place Padres are here in Oaktown, Northern California against the A's, and are facing off against this man, Jesse Hahn, former San Diego Padre, who is 7-4 with a 2-0-1 ERA through just under 90 innings this season. Matt Kemp up to bat here. Third batter of the game, and he's taking this one pretty deep into center. Coco Crisp is going back, but he'll make the catch before the warning track, and that will do it for the first. So a quick 1-2-3 inning for the A's, and that will bring up their offense here in the bottom of the first. Ben Zobras, Billy Butler, Ike Davis, Brett Lowry, all highlighting the new look offense for the A's this 2015 season, as Tyson Ross will take the mound for the Padres, who is 3-5. With a 2.88 ERA in 13 games this season, Coco Crisp up to bat, hitting 2.44, leadoff man for the A's. Here's the three-run pitch from Ross, and that is into center, pretty deep. This is actually going way back. Will Myers is making the catch just before the wall, and that was a close one. I thought Coco hit that one out, but he did not. Will Myers makes the catch, so Ross is a little bit uh, scared by that one, but it's fine. Full count now to Billy Butler with two outs and that is inside and high and that is a walk so Tyson Ross um, allows the base runner hopefully he can get out of it here and he will with a strikeout 94 mile an hour fastball gets past Ike Davis and that will do it for the first inning as it is still 0-0 no hits so far on either side and now we are in the top of the second 1-2 pitch to Justin Upton he's taking this deep into right it will go foul and it is caught in right by Ladendorf. Not Josh Reddick, but Ladendorf. Top of the second action now. Full count to Will Middlebrooks. And that's inside for a ball four. And he is going to be on. So a base runner for the Padres. Something they haven't had yet. As Jesse Hahn is not happy with himself. Now full count to the next batter. This is Alonzo hitting this one in the left. That's going to advance both runners. So now there's runners on first and second for the Padres. We'll see what they can do with it here. As Derek Norris, the former all-star catcher for the A's last year, hitting 223, comes up with runners in scoring position. One out, and he's chopping this one in front of home plate. As Jesse Hahn will throw him out at first, but both runners do advance to second and third. With two outs, we'll see what the Padres can do. As the full count pitch is coming to Jed Jerko, and this swing and a miss is going to do it for the inning. So Jesse Hahn gets out of the inning for the A's. And it is still a 0-0 game. You see here the standings for the NL West. San Diego has a game and a half lead over Los Angeles for first place. They are looking very good at 40 and 27. Hopefully they can keep that going as Marcus Simeon coming over from Chicago in the offseason. White Sox, that is, for the A's. And he's going to strike out. So a nice job here by Tyson Ross getting through the batters after a couple of shaky batters. Earlier on, and that will bring Will Myers up to bat here in the top of the third. Two outs, 2-2 two -two pitch to Will, and he's taking this one deep in a right. That's going back, and it is off the wall. Ladendorf, no, he caught it. I thought that was off the wall. He caught it. Oh, my goodness. So Ladendorf robs him with the catch, and now he's up to bat. We'll see what he can do here at the 1-2 pitch, and he's driving this one into center. Myers is back, and that ball is gone. Tyler Ladendorf making catches in the outfield and hitting bombs at the plate. An excellent outing so far for Ladendorf. Two great catches so far and now a homer. The A's all of a sudden are up 1-0 and the fans are loving it. Ladendorf with the big shot and now we'll go to the bottom of the fourth. Tyson Ross trying to make up for it here. He'll get Ike Davis for the second time today as he's trying to keep it a 1-0 game. Yonder Alonso up to bat now. Top of the fifth. No one on, no one out. Once you pitch to Alonzo, and he is way in front of that changeup. That's a swing and a miss. Jesse Hahn among the American League leaders in ERA with a 201 ERA. I'm sure that's probably going to go down, or at least it has at this moment, just behind Mashinero Tanaka. As Tyler Ladendorf back up to bat now. Nothing's been going on. Bottom of the fifth. Base is empty. Two outs. 1-1 pitch to Ladendorf. He's hitting this one to right, but 
This time Matt Kemp's going to make the catch. And Sladendorf is retired. So we'll move to the sixth inning here in Oakland. Escobar up to bat, full count, and he is going to draw the walk. So a nice job there, being patient. Jesse Hahn not getting the location that he wanted. And as a result, there's a base runner with Matt Kemp up to bat. Two outs, runner on first. Kemp is hitting this one into the gap. It's going back, almost gone off the top of the wall. That will easily score Escobar, and just like that, it is 1-1 here in Oakland. As Matt Kemp gets the RBI double just off the top of the wall, almost a home run, but he'll take it. As he gets the RBI, now Justin Upton up to bat with Kemp at second, and that is hit into the gap. Just like that, two hits, and the A's are down 2-1. Padres take the lead. First, Matt Kemp, and now Justin Upton. 2-1 Padres. Still in the top of the six. Will Millerbrooks can't do anything with Upton at second, but with two hits, the Padres take the lead, and it is now 2-1 here in the seventh actually bottom of the six base is empty no outs 2-2 pitch and Tyson Ross is coming back strong after giving up that one run early as he has himself another strikeout Coco Crisp up to bat now 0 for 2 today base is empty next batter in fact 2-1 pitch to Coco is hit into left Justin Upton is back and he'll make the catch no he won't he drops it Coco is headed a second and he has himself a double a bad route to the ball is uh, the one that Upton takes, and as a result, he drops it. Runner on second in scoring position for the A's. They can score him here with a base hit, which they get, but it's a shallow one. A nice throw by Kemp in right, and Billy Butler will not have an RBI single. He'll just get a single, but that will bring Ike Davis up to the plate with runners on the corners. Two outs, one, two, pitch. Ring him up. He strikes out looking, and Ike Davis for the third time today strikes out, and he has just had it here in Oakland. As Tyson Ross gets out of yet another jam. Bottom of the seventh. Cody Ross up to bat. Ross versus Ross. Tyson deals. And he gets Cody looking. Excellent pitching here by Tyson Ross. Making it look easy. As he gets the other Ross. I believe also a former Padre. Cody Ross. Later in the game. Will Myers in front of that curveball. And he's going to strike out. A little frustrated. But uh, you know his team's got the lead. I guess he's trying to improve on that. But we're going to bring in Benoit here in the bottom of the eighth. He's 2-3 and three on the season. No saves with a 2-6-4 ERA. And Ben Zorbist is the third batter of the inning. 1-2 pitch to Ben. And he is striking out looking. These Oakland A's are looking for something, but it's not coming. These Padres pitchers have their number. Another strikeout. And we're headed to the ninth. Padres up 2-1. Matt Kemp up to bat. Trying to increase his lead here. As he'll get this pitch. And he's taking this one deep to left. Gone. Matt Kemp putting on a show here in Oakland. First to tie up the game at one with an RBI double. Now he gets the solo shot off of Scribner. Wow. Matt Kemp is uh, showcasing some power. Good to have him hitting for some power once again. As he'll come home and it is now 3-1 Padres. They now have a two-run lead. So here we go. Bringing in Craig Kimbrell in the ninth inning. 2-0 with 20 saves with under a 1 ERA. That's what we like to see from Craig as he's trying to get the Padres to their 41st victory. This one is hit over to third. Middlebrooks throws over to first. Alonzo makes the catch. Easy out. Two to go here in the ninth for Kimbrell as Butler is retired. And that will bring Ike Davis to the plate. 0 for 3 so far with 3 Ks. Not going to be a fourth, but he'll hit this one just behind second base as Cabrera is there. And he makes the catch. So he gets that one done. And now there's one out to go. Brett Lowry up to the plate. Also 0 for 3. He's struggling. Full count. And he's hitting this one in right. Is playable for Matt Kemp. And he is under it. And he makes the catch. That's the ball game. Padres win this one. 3-1. to one, An excellent outing. A little bit shaky at first. A close one. But then some clutch hits by Upton and Kemp. And then once again by Kemp in the ninth. Make it a 3-1 game. As Escobar, which I called Cabrera earlier, I'm sure why you were wondering why I said that, um, is celebrating with his teammates. So Escobar, not Cabrera, and his teammates, the San Diego Padres, get the 3-1 lead over the A's. Tyson Ross, your player of the game, seven innings pitched, three hits allowed, one earned run with a walk and nine strikeouts has Oakland's number. And the Padres have their 41st win of the season. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. I'm back making videos. 
and the Padres win this one 3 one So, I hope you guys enjoyed. Once again, make sure to go ahead, like the video, subscribe. Peace.